Hey everyone, welcome to Infinite Realms. Guess what? Star Wars decided to grace us with an epic heroes line. And boy, does it look hideous. And instantly the Hasbros are like, yeah, get kids into it, yeah. And it's like, come off it. Kids who aren't already interested in Star Wars don't care about Star Wars. And it goes back to the same thing every time. You know, Hasbro's not marketing the kids. It's the flat out truth of it. And it kills me when these Hasbros say these things and they're like, oh, yay, oh, yay. And I'm like, God. You know, doing this and saying it's for kids killed Marvel Universe, three and three quarter inch line. It killed G.I. Joe. And it killed, almost killed Star Wars. It did kill Star Wars four inch. From between 2014 and 2016, I believe. And... Huh, well, let's see, what, what can we, we'll do things cheaper, with less articulation, and yeah, that's worked so well in the past. And that's what kills me about this, is that this has never worked. Never once have we seen this idea work, and Hasbro's doing it again. And people are cheering it, acting like, oh boy, yeah, we'll get kids into Star Wars. <sighs> It doesn't work that way. And it hasn't been working that way. And, and this is the frustrating part to me is that, you know, when something doesn't work, you don't keep doing it. I mean, they keep wanting to appeal to adult collectors. Fine. Do that. Do something else for kids. Something new. Something different. Oh, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> People in Hasbro and Mattel are totally devoid of any creativity. That's why, hmm, their stocks are dropping. But nah, I mean, let's just blame it on, you know, electronics or whatever the trend is this week. Like old men do. <laughs> wow. I mean, who knew that this generation's get off of my lawn was going to be like, get off of my, get off of my toys. But yeah, that's where we're at as a society. I mean, we're deep, deep, deep into the nostalgia bait. And that's all we got nostalgia bait and it's not working it has only so much so much traction and the traction is going losing fast you know the glide the glider that is nostalgia is crashing but no let's do it and do it worse reuse repackage recycle i mean it's not hard because you know you don't have to really design anything that's kind of the fun part for them they don't have to do anything I just scale it up, scale it down, whatever. I mean, I can already predict what's going to happen. These are going to sit on the shelves and rot and then, you know, go to clearance. And then we'll forget about them for another five years and then they'll come back. I mean, that's how this cycle works. And people will forget and people will cheer for Hasbro like they're doing now. And uh, so, yeah, um, Hasbro's at their old tricks again. And that, you know what? They don't know any new ones. And it's living proof they have totally lost all creativity. So, keep on the lookout for the Epic Heroes G.I. Joe line soon. Followed by who knows what else. Just, what are they still devoted to? Let me see. Marvel? They already did that. Star Wars. Joe? Yeah, that's about all their focus right now. Because they put Power Rangers on hiatus. Which is corporate speak for cancelled. So yeah, that's uh that's where we're at. Ah, don't forget to like and subscribe. Lord, you just can't make this shit up. Insanity is defined as doing the same decision over and over and expecting a different result. My proof that Hasbro has gone insane.